Hey y'all, it's Charity. I'm here uh, working on my mother-in-law's 50th birthday Hershey wrappers. This is the design I came up with. And because I didn't want to waste paper, I'm going to go ahead and create some water bottle labels on this same um, sheet. This is an eight and a half by 11. So I'm going to, let's get my layers out. I'm going to create another box like I did with this template here. Um, this box needs to be 8 by 2, basically. Not basically, but it does need to be 8 by 2. It can be more right here, but uh, I kind of like mine oversized, so I'm going to go 2 by 2. Um, and the way you... You um, this is how I do it here. I go to no fill, and then I make my stroke a little, a little, just you know, just pretty much thick enough to see. So I will do it there. Um, and you might as well go eight and a half by by five, cause it's gonna print that way anyway. So. Yeah, so this is my base for which I'm going to create. So first of all, and one of my biggest things when designing is I like to bring in my background. And in this particular thing, the background is going to be this denim fabric texture. So I'm just going to, um, I'm actually going to bring it in without messing with that. <coughs> Um, well, I know where it is. It should be. Uh, I'm gonna go with fifteen. And place so it in here. Um. Uh, I'm going to use hold shift and just shrink it down. This is a high definition image, so it has no problem being stretched either. I like to start these water bottles by in the middle, go ahead and putting in whatever the title is or the occasion. Um, so basically, you would really think of your bottle space as probably this much as far as your frontward design. Yeah, I'd say here-ish. So if it was me, I would not create really outside of this domain because again you have variation with your cutting um you kind of just want to keep everything looking consistent so i'm going to get rid of this little triangle really take the opacity down so i'm just gonna i think um I'm not really sure how I want to design these. I like this 50. So I'm going to go ahead and duplicate it. Because I'll use it down here for something. Go ahead and rotate it. Here. Okay, I have an idea. I mean, what about 50s on each side and then happy birthday? Chandra in the middle. So where it's kind of like going across the whole bottle. I usually don't land on a design plan that quick. Quickly, but it's simple enough. One here. 
So they're duplicated again. And bring it on over to the other side. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. I was just going to say happy birthday, Chandra. Um, in this, I like charming. I'm going to say happy. Okay, so I'm going to change it to white so that I can at least see it. It's really simple. Happy birthday, Chandra. I think on water bottles, it's best to keep it simple because it's just clean cut, like water, fresh. Again, that's just my opinion. Um, I'm sure with some time, you can figure out some designs that are not super busy. Um, that are not super busy and still look good. So then now, now that I got basically my size, I'm going to try to take it to 40. Okay, 40 does good, so I'm going to try to take it to 42. 42, 45. Okay. 50 maybe? It was a bit malicious. Okay. So here. I'm going to take it down still. Because again, looking at my parameters. I'm going to take it to 45. Also, guys, when um, if this is your first time doing it and you just want to size it, I would print in grayscale or um like this is my template here so i will remove the background just to print it in black black and white to make sure that it will do what you're hoping it will so yeah and then i'm gonna come to retransform and try to stretch it um taller and i do that by holding shift Stretching it down. Okay. Mm. Okay. So this will. I'm going to add some texture to this. You know what? Mm. Some mm. 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 So now I'm going to take this little background. So that thing will be gone. Okay, and now I can see that it's not really visible. So I'm going to change my color to this blue to see if that helps any. It doesn't, but I'm going to leave it blue for the time being and then come here to um effects and swap out the drop or we'll add a glow no okay and you can see your previews down here so yeah this is just basically not gonna work i'm gonna try a different font <clears throat> 
I'm going to try a different font, different size. I'm going to take it down to 36. Okay. That's a negative. Let's take all of these effects off, though. Let's take it back white. You know what? I'm not going to devalue a plain font. I'm going to come in with Impact Regular. And with her colors being navy, um, denim and navy, is that right? Yeah, navy and gold. Sorry, navy and gold. So I'm gonna come with happy birthday and make it bigger. Let's go with 55. Let's just go with 50. 50, boom. Happy birthday. Let's bring in some effects. Okay, let's take Bevel away. Drop Shadow, you can also go. Let's try to come in with some glow. Okay, like the glow. Keep it. I'm actually going to capitalize Happy Birthday all the way. Going to free transform and make it taller. I'm holding shift as I do this. Okay. okay. And then I'm going to put her name in a script. I'm going to go with Lavandaria. Which um, typically is thick enough. So I'm going to bring Chandra in in white. I mean, it can be much bigger. So I'm going to go with 48. I'm just going to bring it up. Mm. Let's see, let's bring in some texture with Chandra. Actually, let's make Chandra gold. Oh, yeah, this is it. This is it. Let's make it much bigger. So then I'm going to edit, free transform, make it a little shorter. I like the bigness of it, just make it a little shorter. Okay. Actually, no. Not feeling Chandra. Let's let's make leave Chandra white. Then doing that makes it look gold. So I'm just gonna put Chandra in a regular font. Yeah, I'm gonna do the same rule. Okay, Chandra go white. Mm -mm. Okay, this is going to be the text. I'm going to line this up. I'm going to print and then I'll show you guys how, how I assemble soon.